Today's video will be talking about mitosis, which is the process of cell division. So the cell is going to divide into two cells, so it's basically going to split itself into two, and then we have two identical cells as the result. Mitosis is part of the cell cycle, so within the cell cycle as a whole, there's quite a few stages, and mitosis is one of them. In these other stages, there's things like DNA replication and the cell is resting and in some cases there's regulatory checks to see if everything is okay for mitosis to occur. So we're going to talk about the cell cycle as a whole in another video and in this video we're going to talk about exactly what happens in mitosis. So before mitosis there's this stage of interphase where the cell basically doubles in size and there's a lot of protein synthesis. The reason that this occurs is because if this didn't happen, the cell will divide and get smaller and smaller. So the cell doubles in size so that when it splits, it splits into the normal size that it should be. So the first step of mitosis is called prophase. In this stage, the nucleolus, which you can see here, breaks down and the chromosomes condense to form something called chromatids. So these are these structures which you can see here. Also the centrosomes start moving to other ends of the cell and we have this mitotic spindle which is like a microtubule which starts to form. Anyway, these start moving to opposite ends of the cell. The next stage is called prometaphase and what happens here is the nuclear envelope or the nuclear membrane breaks down and these uh, chromosomes here get attached to these microtubules which we're forming here from the middle point here, so they attach via the middle of the chromosome from this structure which is called a centromere. So they attach onto the centromere of the chromosomes and this is what happens in prometaphase. In metaphase, all that happens is there's an alignment to the center or the equator of the cell. And then in the stage of anaphase, the chromosomes break from this attachment point, so they break from this centromere and they start moving to opposite ends of the cell. Finally, we have this stage of telophase, which is where a nuclear membrane starts forming around these chromatids and then the chromosomes basically start unwinding, so they start looking like this. And then we have cytokinesis, where the cell basically splits into two. So if you've made it this far into the video, I'm going to show you what all of these stages which we've just mentioned look like in an actual cell. So here is some footage showing exactly what mitosis looks like in a normal cell. And if you found this video useful, make sure you give this video a like. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions, write them in the comment section below and I'll do my best to answer as many as I can.